assign to farming, assign all three. Now we're at least getting the most out of our current population. We got to put them all to work. Did the stream go down? I don't have any I don't have any notifications on my end that the stream went down. All right. Wouldn't surprise me if Twitch started having problems again. Boy, yeah, what a shot. What a shocker. Twitch having issues? What? No. Never heard that one before. I was so confused. I started seeing out of the corner of my eye chat was flying by and I'm like, eh, that's not normal. I'm not that funny. <laughs> I'm not that clever. All right, unleash the red stag menace once again. Oh no, now it actually is Bambi. Still, your donation will be, you know, very, very cherished here. Don't make me feel worse than I already do. Get out of here. Okay. Pow. Yao Guai Cage number two online. What am I out of? Apparently I'm out of carrots. There's no way I'm out of carrots. They're in the workbench. Unless, oh, wait, no, I'm an idiot. I planted them all. All right, well, we'll figure out the rest of them eventually. Not too worried about all that. We should have enough food planted to where we'll get... Yep, okay, we got number 12. Where's number 12? Is it you? You look new. Aha, you are new. Come on, no, get off the farm. <laughs> You're providing too much value. Get off the farm <laughs> over to the pillories. Does this count as part of the three months pro probation period? Uh, uh, sure. Yeah. That's probably my favorite job in this game. They'll just willingly go. Thank you for joining our society. I'm glad you heard our message and swam all the way across the Boston Harbor. Now get to the pillories. Get over there. We're closed. We're out of room. Oh, do you have any cash on you first? Hold on. Excuse I me, ma'am. I just want to trade a few things. Sure. Yeah, before you head over to jail, real quick, uh, I'll take your $1. Ooh, you even have some food? Definitely give me that gun. No, you, you don't get a gun. Not here. Everyone else is in charge of defending, not you. Now, once they're in there, how do we lock them in? It's kind of weird, because even if we get attacked, they'll still willingly leave the pillory. For the jobless, can't I build more shops? I could. I could, yeah. Who the hell are you? Is that another one? Uh. Hmm. I don't know what to do with this one, because I was assuming we were at 11 before. All right, fine. Welcome to the farm, corn. Thank you, kind sir. Tanik, thank you for the tier one. I could disable their AI using commands, but then that just feels like I'm cheating. Woo, 58 water. I'm gonna take that water, sleep it off. 
Let's get back. Let's just sell this all, get some bulk. We need bulk steel. We need bulk wood. We need, a, we need quite a few more things. Using mods for raids isn't cheating. It's not console commands. It's Creation Club. All right? It's, it's, it is still in the game. Plus, it's a tax write-off. Right? So don't, don't buy Creation Club content. This is honestly the only one, though, that looked kind of cool. Just because they still are... Just because the acronym is CC for both doesn't mean the Council Commands and Creation Club are the same. Yeah, I paid for these cheats, damn it. I'm gonna use them. It's part of the vacation experience. I had to buy the extra package. <clears throat> Looking to buy? Let's see what you have. Here's what I've got. At least she has her cash. Fertilizer. Gear. Beautiful. Keep it coming. Yes. I can probably make a ton of jet right now. Okay, not as much as I thought I could. But still a good amount. I have a lot of jet on me. Oh, I did not realize these were repaired. Okay, let's do it. If you guys have not seen the massive mayhem uh, Todd machine of murder, which switch is... Okay, these are for the cannons. Yeah. Okay, those are for the cannons. Now watch. Why am I tracking a quest? We got all four. Four for four. Come on. Oh, how the hell did that one escape? Okay, well, the other ones went flying. Oh, Jesus. Hold on, wait. I want to see the rest of the show. You guys can't shoot to the water. Oh, look at that one go. Five stars. <laughs> what a shot. For our island entertainment, we've got a great show for you all. People who purchase our platinum package will be will be able to witness an amazing show of murder. And then all the loot just deposits right back into the island vacation refunds. Hold on, we've got a runner. <laughs> we've got one trying to escape. Give me all that. I need to create a net for any of the ones that try to swim away. I think I got them all though. Oh, shit. And it's only 200 caps. To repair them all. Nice and easy. 200. We calculated it last time. We make about 600 caps back, so it's about 400 profit each time. As long as we get them all. That was a good one, though. Tenek, thank you very much for the 50 bits. Have I heard of... Are you talking about, like, multi-level marketing? Yeah. It's like uh, Vera Life. Isn't that the most famous one? I almost said the best one. Isn't that the best one? Most highly regarded? Schmuck, thank you for stopping by. Herb Herbalife, that might be the one I was thinking of.
Just want to let you know I've been watching you for the last year, and it's really helped this background noise whilst I work on my exams here in the UK. You know, if you do really good on your exams, I deserve half credit. That's all I'm saying. If you end up getting your degrees, I at least want half of a degree. Otherwise, um, you know, I, I, what was it all for? That was a good showing of our water show. I'm disappointed it was as foggy as it was, though. Also, hey, come on. No more, all right? The people visiting thank our you, island only sure. pay for one show. They get one show. Eric, thank you very much for the Prime. Thank you for using your Twitch Prime to say no to ads on this channel. Say yes to ads on every other channel. Except for my friends. Also say no to ads on their channels. More water. We're starting to really stack it up. I'm sure I have something. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I love that. Just I'll sprint up. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> like I'm in fifth grade. I'm only asking for enough to feed my kids. What? Another, ano another anonymous. Thank you very much. That's really kind of you. <laughs> Hi. But thank you very much for five gifted uh, tier one subs and for revealing a secret alert that I didn't even know existed. <laughs> thank you. It's very kind of you. Ooh, this is an upgrade to my armor? Really? I found a buff. Okay, all right, I like that. Let's focus on getting all the stuff that we want to get. Sure, I'll, I'll get antiseptic. Do I need it? I don't know. Concrete? We do need concrete. Plastic, I guess. All right, I'm just buying all the junk. Screw it. Give me all the junk. Yeah. <gasps> A kickball. Yes. Okay, we need the kickball. All right, all right. We got the kickball. Perfect. Now we can build uh, like a beach volleyball court. It might be really bad, but <laughs> as long as I have a kickball, we can, you know, have some kind of vacation games, right? 264? That'll do it. Still have plenty of cash to keep abusing her store, though. Finally. You know what? I, I don't really need a Wilson because I have about 12 Wilsons. Who the hell are you? Target spotted. He's wearing a bucket hat and a trench coat. All right? If you've ever seen Always Sunny, you know how ridiculous trench coats are. Get over here. You, you're new. You're not welcome here either. Get to the pillories. Now, get to the pillories. Unnamed settlers. You disgust me. That is kind of a cool hat, though. That's kind, of, that's kind of a cool hat. I'm not going to lie. I kind of like that hat. Give me that hat. I just want to trade a few things. Of course. Yeah, I'm taking the hat. All right. Now, off. Off with ye. Is that enough to power all these? All right, it is. Quit going so slow, would you hurry? Hey, hurry up. Come on. Prisoners don't grow on trees now. We need you to get into position. Let's only wait a little bit longer. Uh, you know what? Hold on. 
We need to put Wilson somewhere. Or I actually, we'll have to name the kickball Chuck. Because in the movie Castaway, the ball is Wilson. <laughs> it does. It actually lets us change his name. Chuck. <laughs> Go, Chuck. Go. Woo. This is so fun. I finally have an inanimate object friend. You know how long it's taken me on this island? 12 settlers and not a single one has given me as much enjoyment as this ball. Uh. Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, Chuck? Thank you, kind sir. Ch Ch Chuck! Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna lose Chuck. Come here. Stop it. Behave yourself. Okay, you can hang out up here with defense and Todd. That's gotta keep Chuck safe, right? If we keep him nestled right in there. Drunken Blackjack, thank you for the prime. Can we make Chuck the, the mayor? What would my position be? I guess I'm the governor. Yeah, I'm the governor. Chuck can be the mayor. All right, now let's wait another day. If we can keep up this process, keep it rolling a little bit, we'll be able to increase our funds. It'd be more efficient if we did grind XP, but I just don't want to grind XP anymore. Squizzguard, yes. Uh, progress is going really well. We're coming pretty far. Although we are going to have to start wrapping this up sometime soon. It's kind of hard to have a grand finale because there's no real challenge challenge. I did see a few people mention both on the VOD channel and on stream that they've tried this out on their own and they were able to get a circuitry drop in the green duffel bag. You guys remember that first green duffel bag over by the containers? We checked that one quite a bit the first few streams. I've heard people say that they were able to get lucky and drop circuitry within the first day. Somebody said they were also doing this on survival mode, which I totally respect for kind of jumping in with no direction on this island. Survival, like if we were playing on survival mode, think about it now, it would be trivial. Other than maybe combat being a little bit more difficult. Build a cannon, uh, an incredible, well, okay. Kind of what I want to do, and this is going to sound really dumb, is build a bunch of cannons in one straight line and launch Chuck from one end of the island all the way to the other in a series of cannons. But I think that would be almost impossible. Yeah, I mean, it took us long enough to make progress at first. But if you're on survival and you're able to get lucky and drop uh, circuitry right away, at that point, the challenge is over. If you're able to get circuitry... You're able to get the camera, which is a static spawn. That gives you the crystal. Once you have circuitry and crystal, you have the recruitment beacon. Once you have that, you get a settler or two, you start your farm. You have unlimited food on survival Steve, mode. I'm sure I and water is you. as easy as it can get. Sure, let's take a look. Here's what I've got. Cran eating titty. <laughs> Hello. How are you? Thank you for watching the VOD channel and thank you for stopping by. Actually, I'm going to go... Alright, you know what I need to build here? This is just another dumb min-maxing efficiency thing. I'm just gonna build a crafting table, uh, right here. Cause then I can access the crafting inventory from it. Hi. You wanna do some trading? Let's see what you have. Great. Tenek, that sounds like a tough deal, but I'm glad you seem uh, happier. Congratulations, that's a tough call to make. Same. <laughs> and it was also a tough call to make, so. Lots more gears. Get the camera. Mom, get the camera. Looking to 
by. I'll take a look. Sure. Here's Did my money not go up? Oh, my money didn't go up. What the hell? I wonder, I wonder if we could literally just sit here on the bed, sleep for two days, check the inventory whenever we get water and just bing, bang, boom, bop between her and where we're at. Okay, hold on. The brain wants you to think if you work hard enough, you'll get to move up the ranks quickly. Makes it, they never let you have real emotions. They have three main rules. Always have a good day. Be on time. Miss one day and you're fired. I have a student mentality. Be open. If I can hand that job. If you're in the shower, be aware of one source marketing. Um, I will, uh, I'll, I'll keep an eye out. Appreciate you looking out. But that does sound like a shitty situation. Also, if that is a copy pasta, then that's a pretty good copy pasta because uh, it doesn't really read like a copy pasta. <laughs> I can't believe we're all we're almost we've almost been on this island for a year. I've spent most of it sleeping. This is a great gig. Get our water. Excuse me. I'm Back sure to Fedora. You need. Sure. Let's take a look. Here's what I've got. Mm -hmm. Don't really need any more craftables from her. But by the time we do that trade with her. And we run back over here. The human volleyball show will be ready to go. Are you guys ready? <laughs> like it's like we're actually at a resort and this is our oh god damn it. They're not they're not powered on so they didn't fill up. I gotta keep forgetting to put the switch on. You know ever since you guys suggested using a switch I just get more confused and I forget my responsibility. I'm tired of the switch. Yeah, it's human volleyball. Or close to it. I did repair them. They just weren't powered on. But whatever. We'll get more water, we'll get more cash. Yeah, can I assign one of the prisoners that I have locked up to just be my switch person? It's a really important job. It's tantamount to the success of this industry. Oh, no, 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 no. Not a switch slave. Everybody on this island is working voluntarily. They heard the message. They came... Even the people that are in the uh, pillory, they didn't really say no. I just assigned it to them and they said, yeah, sure. Sounds fun. I'd like to live my life in this position for the rest of my life. I just spit all over my monitor. That's gross. Excuse me. Looking to buy? Sure. Let's take a look. Great. All right, we're up to 1800. Ah, okay. Now we can do the human volleyball water show extravaganza on the murder machine of mayhem.
have it your way. We got trouble. Oh, uh, okay. Three out of four. That's still pretty good. Oh, that one's way up. That's a good shot. <laughs> I, I gotta go in vets when they're up in the air again. That one's invisible. Oh, there he goes. You can barely see him. Look at his outline. Ow, ow, ow. I'm actually on fire. Todd, can you cover me? Watch out, Todd. I don't want to accidentally shoot you when you're Howard. <laughs> nice work, everybody. Your bravery is exemplary. Who the hell are you? Okay. All right, I have a new job for you. We'll put this person right here. See, she said sure. She said sure. Not a slave. Willing participant. Although one could argue that she does say sure because of the implication. Shut up. All right. I'm a, I'm a good island owner, okay? I treat my people well. They're fed well. All right, so after doing the water extravaganza, a murderous mayhem on the monster machine, we can then whoop right over here. Where we've got these two. They're actually going to survive because they're not technically arena contestants. Can I just sneak here? Like if I, if I sit right here and I go sneak mode, are they going to be able to get me? Yeah, I need a better view. Time to access Creation Club content. Da 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 da. All right, I should be safe up here. They're worried about how strained their necks are before defending themselves. You can't get me up here. Uh, nope, nope, this is home base. Hey, don't run too far now, okay? Honestly, I really respect her just trying to punch the thing. Oh god. Oh god, it's running towards the corn farm to defend the corn. What are you shooting at? Bjork, there's no way you're that confident you're going to hit those shots. I mean, it's halfway across the island. All right. Might as well go mop up this mess. Let me take the loot first. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Back to the tower. Haha, <laughs> sucker. Now you must go feast on the common men. What else we got? This weapon sucks. Recoil compensated fiery laser rifle. Oh, this is cool. I like this.
All right, at least I got XP for one of them. Guess my good karma's paying off. Thank you, kind sir. Eleven months already. Wow, Tilda. DB. Thank you. Eleven months is crazy. Thank you very much. Almost one year. I like how it had to pronounce the tilde as well. Okay, we should be able... Actually, before we do that, let's... Let's build on the... Uh, oh, see? Yay. Nice. Way to get back into position without me having to tell you. Let's expand the arena floor. Oh crap, now it's floating. Now it's gonna be ugly. But wait, we learned before that we could grab one and grab all. And we can just move them down. That is so awesome. Thank you to whoever told me about that. Come on. Worth every septum. Close enough. I'm going to take that as a win. Lurker Dirks, thank you for the bits. Got to get ourselves some bulk wood. Let's sleep for a few days, get our water, do our trade, get some cash, get some wood, finish building out that platform, get our first... Let's get our first Deathclaw spawner in there. Thanks for the entertainment on your lunch break. Thank you for joining me on your lunch breaks. Are the, these are XM3s, Tenek. Are you talking about my headphones? They're XM3s. They're actually not great gaming headphones, especially because they can't go wireless. They can, but there's a huge delay. So like they're only good for listening to music. You like the design of, I don't mind the design of Boston. I just think the performance when you get down there is a little sketchy sometimes, especially on console. We might've waited. Or slept long enough. Got work to do. Can't talk now. <laughs> Excuse me? You work for me, Fedora. Come on. Uh, Don't be uh, like that. Do some I'm sure I have something you need. I'll take a look. Got a lot of work to do. I'm too busy to talk to my only customer ever in the history of this shop and the history of this island. bulk wood then we can just offset it with all of our water 570 ish caps still made money got our bulk wood
Yeah, that was a frustrating moment. Not Fedora's brightest moment. All right, what the hell's going on here? Uh, got it. Damn, I'm going to have to get bulk wood again, aren't I? I can afford it. But I would like to not eat into my cap savings. Repaired, 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 repaired. Okay, they're all repaired. Now I want the other end to just be death claws. We wall this whole thing in, wall it off. None of them can escape. And then that will essentially just continually farm animals and whatnot. This one functioning is normal. So we still have the death farm going. Food farm, water farm. Everything's kind of rolling on all cylinders now at this point. I'm gonna need more bulk wood. Hello, Schizo. I am doing well, and I'm glad you stopped by. Thank you for watching the VODs. Of course, it's always appreciated. Very much so appreciated. We love our VOD channel viewers. They are the real MVP. It is very uh, assuring that people enjoy those. I stream during the workday for you. Yeah, right now, right now I have to try and aim for about three to four p.m. CST in the future. Uh, my goal would be to aim for noon my time. I would like to stream earlier in the day because then if the stream does go longer, I'm not completely wiped out by the end of it. My back hurts, my feet hurt, everything hurts. I'm about to make your bank account hurt. Hey. Looking to buy? I'll take a look, sure. Here's what I've got. Wood. Yeah. Both wood still came out with money. Oh. Duh. I completely forgot to actually build the death claw cage. Oh, the boys are hungry. Oh, the boys are ready to play. Don't worry, you two. I've got you in the pillory, but soon you'll be assigned to a, uh, a platform. You'll be in the animal arena. For the entertainment of all of our guests. 
Can we trade a few things? Go ahead. <laughs> Wait, no, there's no way. What? Wait, I can just talk to him here? I'd like to trade some items. Sure thing. Yeah, sure. Uh, yeah, no, no problem. Let me just reach into my back pocket here. Uh, I got some loose change you can have. Let me get your undershirt and jeans. All right, we got to get him out of the pillory at least. Come on, would you guys move, please? No, no, stop. Away. You. Oh my... There we go. Okay, we'll do that there. Brilliant. All right, sweet. We actually got a level up. What was I going to try and make? Animal friend? Yeah, because we want to build the beta wave emitter. In order to do that, I have to get animal friend. All right, this probably isn't going to work all that well, but let's just see. Can we snap this one? No, we can't. It looks like it. Oh, it looks like it really wants to snap. It's so close. It really wants to, but it won't. That's right. Let's take one of them. You get over here. Get on the platform. Thank you, kind sir. You should totally make a cannon to shoot Chuck into the faces if you're willing slaves in the pillory. <laughs> That's actually not a bad idea. Hamster, I appreciate that. That's a great suggestion. Um, and our in... Oh, who is that? T-shirt, jeans, patchwork on the knees. All right, we'll throw him in waiting. We're out of room, everybody. Okay, so anybody who comes here is coming here to be one of our entertainers. I, why is it in resources? Resources, miscellaneous, uh, torture device. So we could put them... Let's put them behind because they're going to need an access point into the arena. So we can put them back here. Like right here. We could go boom. 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 Actually, let's raise them up even higher. I'm giving them all the stairs they might need because I don't trust my uh, settlers to not be idiots when it comes to getting upstairs.
Perfect. Wholesome island activities. You. Once again, I must remind you all, these are willing participants. They're having fun. Okay, it's just, it's, it's wholesome gladiatorial activity. Also, there's no... I think the pillory is the only way you can assign a settler to just, like, stand in one spot. Like, if you want to tell them, hey, go here, that's, like, the only way. I have no interest in making this a supremely aesthetically pleasing arena. Oh crap, I'm out. All right, hold on, I'll be back. You guys have fun, I'll be back. We're almost there. Chuck would make it aesthetically pleasing. All right, fine. We can put, we can build a Chuck cannon <laughs> above the arena. Oh, that would cool. That would be cool if we could get them into power armor. The bikes that generate power and have them will be the ones. Whoa, you can do that. Bikes that generate power. Is that a thing? All right, hold on. I want to see if we can do that. Do you have to start the vault DLC to have it? Let's check. Our... It's not going to be in generators, right? Miscellaneous? Pitching machine. No, it's not in there. You need to start the DLC for them? Then what good is that? No, I mean, either way, it works well enough. Ooh, hey, everybody, gather round, gather round. We're almost ready for another wonderful water magic murder mystery machine of, uh... M m m m m m massiveness. Start the water show. If that's what you want. Four for four. A new record. Never happened before. Holy crap, that one's gone. <laughs> he's in the next zip code. Quick, he's trying to escape and get to the harbor. It's, <laughs> it's human skeet shooting. Another successful water show. That was a great one. That was really good. That's what we have to do now with this. It's starting to evolve. We have to try and shoot them while they're in midair. Hey, 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 get back here. 
Now where the hell you think you're going? You, back in the pillory. Now, that's right, that's right. You don't get to enjoy the show for free now, okay? Pay your dues like everyone else. Good work, Todd. You run a tight ship over here. Thanks, boss. Appreciate it. No problem. Keep working hard, boys. Did I sell all the water? Ooh, gosh, I keep forgetting. It's so hard to remember. But power on. Then we have to run up to the top and repair them. You know what I really want to build? Steel. I'm, uh, I'm, I ran out of copper? How the hell did I run out of copper? We should be able to afford bolt copper just in the cash that we have saved. But with all the armor we just got too, should be good regardless. Hopefully there's water bottles in here. Yes, sir. Thank you. Take those. You want to do some trading? Sure. Let's take a look. Let me know where did my armor go. Did I sell it? Not like I really need it. Yeah, we're still gonna be down five hundred caps. I guess I don't need jet as much anymore. So let's come out of that trade making cash. I'll take my bolt copper. You want to do some trading? I've got a few minutes to browse. Here's what I've got. And then if I buy bulk steel, what is that? 1161. So I'll come out negative in this trade. But I do have some weapons. My pistol, plasma rifle, we can deal those off. I don't really need the combat rifle anymore. I like this laser rifle. It's just cooler. All right, we're coming out losing 500 caps. I'll make that trade. Minus 500 caps, bulk copper, bulk steel. I'm probably really low on wood. Where are we at on wood? Still a 45. Let's use the rest of our wood to try and build up the rest of the uh, animal murder arena. Sorry, nature preserve. Na it is a nature preserve. Don't. Don't let all these people who are complaining about my island tell you that it is anything other than a nature preserve. It is good. It is wholesome. We have several zookeepers who are volunteers. I could sell my ammo, but if I find a gun that just happens to have ammo or like, I just don't want to find a cool gun that I want to use and be out of ammo. go into our large cages finally finally death claw cage about damn time we only need a little small generator boy death claw cage is powered up Bjork, get out of the arena, please. You're putting yourself in danger, Bjork. I'm pretty sure there's a collection of walls. Is it in prefabs? I thought there was a collector collection of like raider-esque walls. Is it fences? Yeah, it's the junk fences. So we can just kind of shittily here build out junk fences. They, I don't think they snap. They're just supposed to be thrown up like this. As long as the animals can't get through it. 
all I'm worried about. No, Bjork, Bjork. That looks kind of cool. Can we see inside? Uh, it's not the greatest view ever, but we can at least kind of see inside. All I know is that the animals are not getting out of here. No, they won't fit, won't fit. They won't fit any of those exits. The only way they can get out is if they go out right here. Or maybe right here. <laughs> I'm small little hole in the wall I missed. There. Problem solved. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. E. Best of luck to you, ma'am. Thank you, kind sir. Cassie, thank you very much for the prime. I need to assign someone to this. Oh, he's like, hmm, I need more prisoners. I need more people. Mm, I think I, the information I'm gathering right now, I, I really should torture somebody today. Yeah, that seems like the smart move. Thank you, kind mm. sir. Imprisonment seems optimal for the continuation of this place. Grifter, thank you for the prime. I hope you're having a marvelous Monday. There we go. There's more alliteration. I need more of that on the stream. Marvelous Monday. Majestic Monday. Monday-tastic Monday. Muntastic. Yeah, we went from butt naked, not a single item on us, to constantly swimming in a circle for hours and hours and hours, to now death claws. This place runs on imprisonment, unpaid labor, animal cruelty, and, uh, excuse me. First off, labor is completely paid, okay? If we go check, I'm going to prove you wrong right now. I'm going to go check the workbench inventory. Hmm. Eight bottle caps. Eight bottle caps. That is the pay that my settlers have raised. Okay, so the next time you want to say that I'm not treating them well and they're not getting paid. Uh, oh, also, hmm, that's weird. 27 carrots that they can nibble on to give them the basic sustenance needed to require and perform bodily functions. Hmm, weird. Where'd you say that? Oh, but no, it's it's only on unpaid labor and, and torture. Oh, that's weird. I have seven beds for uh, 15. F when the hell did 15 people get here? Who's telling everybody about my island? <laughs> Who's telling it? What the hell? This is a secret place. Is it you, Jabbo? It's Jabbo, isn't it? He's telling everybody about the island. Moth girl, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Looking so by. I think what I want to do is I've got a few minutes next, because it should require much less items and just like wealth and everything. Where's my purified water? Did I sell it to you? I waited for two days and we don't have purified water. Okay. Who's going to die? Who am I killing? Why is there not water in the workbench? It's been 48 hours. Oh, but thank God we have 70 carrots in there. Again, I treat them well. I'm trying to get in a uh, warler. I'm trying to get in a really good uh, cadence where every other day I'll have a what's it called? Um, a VOD on the second channel. So tomorrow, I think going up on the second channel will be day four. 
This is day five, so day four will go up on the VOD channel tomorrow. Okay, you know what I want? Hear me out. Hear me out, y'all. This is gonna be cool. Okay, so what if... Wait, you know what we need? It just hit... Wait, what's in here? Settlement ambush kit. Security camera? What? Hold on, hold on. How does this work? How does this bad boy work? Security camera? Okay, if I build it there... Hold on. I want to investigate this real quick. Oh, classic. Security camera's on. I assume I have to connect some kind of computer to it. Security camera monitors? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, all right, all right, hold on. <laughs> this is gonna be really cool if this works. Where does the... View cameras. Is there a power? I don't see a power switch on it or like a power connector thing for a wire. It needs passive power. Set up a pylon. It's probably, I would assume, in connectors, power pylon. out of here what <laughs> that's so cool okay all right all right all right all right hold on hold on wait i love this now we'll, we'll be able to just observe our society from our secret dungeon camera room so we're gonna store all of this for now it's not gonna go here and the camera certainly won't go there we're gonna want our camera to be somewhere with a better overlook of this whole area. I want like a master control room. So we need a tall wall. Of course I'm out of wood. Why wouldn't I be out of wood? Security fence? Ah. It'd be nice if I had like a double tall. Narrow. I need some kind of platform. We'll figure this out. Well, if you think about it, we could start small. Right, like here, get a nice view. Make sure, make sure they're working. Make sure they're putting in their hours properly. It's probably gotta be a bit lower. It's probably good. No, I want it to have a good view. Oh, 
what a buzzkill. I want it right on this corner. Boom. Maybe a little bit lower. Got it. That's it. We're going with that. What else do we have in here? Decorations. A fat man crate. Order shell. These are just random decorations. Sandbag wall. Oh, you know where we could put the sandbags? These would be perfect down on the beach. I can only build one though. This is gonna, it's gonna level up the entire uh, Todd uh, extravaganza day. You know, that whole event. So now we'll go into power. Make sure that this one is connected. Come on. Come on. Thank you, kind sir. Oh, you're so full of crap. What is that garbage? It, like, it barely clips through, so it's not counting it. Votenzo, thank you for the prime. I know exactly what we're going to do with the Todd Howard <laughs> and again, the security footage. All right, all right. At least we got this one powered up. We're just going to put the camera there. Make sure that we can keep our farm under. Look at him working. Look at all that. I mean, this is teamwork. This is society. I, in fact, live in a society. All right, we're going to need a separate camera. All right, we're actually going to move one of the Todds. We're going to relocate one of them. They're going to have a very special job. I mean, it, it, it's quite literally the most important job in the entire settlement. <laughs> <laughs> okay and are, are we lined up is does that look lined up to y'all i can't tell i can't get under the camera to make sure that it's perfectly it looks good maybe we could move todd slightly to the right but i think we'll just leave him for now okay now we're gonna come down to power I can afford a lot of generators right now. Power on, generator active. Okay, we've got another camera set up. I should probably have one over here to make sure that my haircut, uh, you know, that my barber is working. Right? I don't want the barber taking any days off. It's important for settlement happiness. We must keep her under our watchful eye at all times. Is that a joke? You resin my berries right now? Got 
Got it. Just had to turn that one slightly. Votenzo, thank you for the 100 bits, and I really appreciate the kind words. Thanks for watching. Okay. Oh, okay. I know what we can do here. Let's go to our walls. And on this one, we'll go back to our... There we go. That one should have a good view. Again, I know it's not the most aesthetically pleasing thing, but it's 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 function over form right now. I have a pretty good idea though. What if we go into power lights? Come to a street light. Build one of those up. Go back. Can we throw a camera? Oh, we can't. That's a bummer. I was hoping we'd be able to. All right, regardless. Regardless. Look, we even have our secret operations bunker built on top of this right up on top of this hill it's made for us we can come right up in here <laughs> into our into our secret operations bunker damn it's not powered damn All right, let's check out the cameras. All right, our first security test is now live. Let's see if we can take a, you know, a trip away from our main island. And wow, look at that. We can even see. Yes. Hey, I'm asking myself why I'm away. I wonder if the death claw has been captured yet. Hmm. Oh, I guess I can just check the security cameras. Awesome. Okay. Oh, and they are hard at work, right at home. Look at them go. Wow, producing all of these carrots. Can you turn the camera at all? Doesn't look like you can turn the camera. Uh. Okay, that is not what I want to see. What the hell's going on here? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I think Todd broke the game. <laughs> the one we're supposed to be seeing him, I think it broke. I mean, we might have put him too close. Oh Jesus! Fuck! How much? How much progress did I just lose? It looked like the camera was right here. See, this is what it should have been. This is what the camera was supposed to see. It was supposed to just open up right here. <laughs> Uh, 
Let's try and load our save. Ah, oh, God, I'm gonna have to rebuild all of that. God fucking damn it. That actually pisses me off. Now I'm mad. The farm's not much, but it's something. Fuck that. That actually pissed me off. Fuck you. Fuck off. Fuck all of you. Fuck you, YouTube. <laughs> God damn it. That's really frustrating. It's like the only time I've actually gotten upset during this whole run. And it's like 10, it's 10 minutes of progress. It's not even that bad. In an actual challenge, I've lost way more progress and gotten less upset. That's just dumb as fuck. I don't even remember what the fuck I was doing now. Oh, I'm so upset. I'm sorry. Sorry, chat. I am actually really, really heated. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> Fucking asshole. All right, we're good. Yeah, creepy, creepy Todd haunting my security cameras broke the goddamn game. It'd be funny if he didn't make me lose all the fucking progress. <laughs> Douche. All right, at least all this works. Mm, probably have to build a more effective. One that ends without an empty stomach. Oh. Well, if you survive this fight, your stomach won't be empty forever. Oh crap. I need to have the I need to have the death claw on the same power line as the others. Oh, uh, best of luck to you, ma'am. Go get him. <laughs> Go get him. Yeah, good. Run, run, run. The society is forfeit. How the hell did they get out? Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. I never turned off your power. Get back in there, Bambi. Oh my God, they're going at each other now. Okay, hey, whoa, hey, how are you breaking the power? You guys can't just invent your own rules. Oh shit, wait, the Yao Guai won? <laughs> Need to get back to Diamond City one of these days. Biggest town I ever saw. This town's bigger than Diamond City. Like at this point by a lot. Oh, poor settler. You shall be missed. Hold on now, don't get in the pillories. Okay. Yeah, they all kept their power. I wonder why they just all flipped off. I'm not complaining that they did, though. I'm glad we got to see it all. Uh, we're gonna move you from the beach location up here. You'll be next in line. Sure. Go get up there. He's getting on the platform. Good. Who are you? Is that another? You're another T-shirt. Ah, back hurts. My feet hurt. Everything hurts. Oh, he just tried to run away. 
He's trying to get away from me. Crap's coming in pretty good. All right, Todd, I know I'm upset at you for breaking my game, but I'll forgive you as long as you can make this a good round of skeet shooting. Another round of the classic beach game, human skeet shooting. How many will land? We've got two and three and four. It's a four for four round. All four up into the air, pirouetting, spinning slowly. How many shots can he land before he hits the water? Only one, underwhelming. Paying off. The crop's been growing pretty good lately. I'm getting good at this. I'm getting much more quick and efficient with it. Oh, there's always one that tries to swim away. Okay, it's not quite a petting zoo that we have up here, but we're just going to call it a petting zoo. I mean, I can under I can understand why the security cameras are super game breaking. It, it, it makes sense because, I mean, you're essentially loading the player into an awkward position where they can't move like you're teleporting them around the map. It, it just it makes too much sense why they are funky. Okay, don't remember assigning you there or giving you any permission. Also, we already have a fedora in camp. To the pillories, you go. Next in line, who will be murdered next? We've got a near endless supply of newcomers. All ready to die, all excited for death. Okay, guys, can you please stop telling all of your friends about this? Who put out the Facebook invite? There's way too many people willing to join the arena. I, I really like that they want to, you know, fight for glory and honor and all that. But come on. We only have so much room here. I got to close this thing off somehow. I need... Okay, I think I know what to do. So we need a door. Like that. We can go back to wood walls. Like that. Grab a door. Uh, no, it should be a powered one. Damn. Okay, we need more wood. That's easy enough. Get up into the pillories, okay? <sighs> it sounds like my dog after he takes half a walk around the block. <sighs> Or me, if I take half a walk around the block. Hope you ain't one of them simps here to spy on me. I have no plans on spying on you, Fedora. No, never, no. I'll take a look, sure. Here's what I've got. Shipment of wood. Yeah, yeah. I wish I could. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come up with more lyrics. Oh, there's no way I'm losing money on this trade. Eat shit, Fedora. Yeah, I'm making money. 
You thought you were going to come out on top? No, not on my island. When did I stop wearing a chess piece? I honestly, I don't remember. But now I look even more ridiculous than before. I'm not too worried about my stats right now. That's a childish thing to care about. Alright, so this should be simple as... Power door that for some reason can only face the wrong way. Fantastic. Okay. We'll make it work. Because then we'll go... Star Wars music. I shouldn't scrap that. That's a waste of resources. But we can go with a... 5 gen. Boom. Boom. Those two together. Pretty dumb how we have to build this, but easiest way is going to go power pile on there. Switched power pylon here. Okay, I'm tracking. Tracking. I just gotta think through this for a second. Another one there. I can connect there. Get rid of that. We'll get rid of all the- actually, I, I can keep that wire because they're gonna have to connect that way regardless. Power's on for all of those. Get out of my way. Scrap that. Back into the arena. None of them have power, as they shouldn't. Looking for trouble, I hope. Thank you, Farming kind sir. As honest, as honest work gets. Okay, this one is getting power. Oh. There we go. Now when all the cages are filled up, we close. Battle commences. Let's double check one more time. These should all have power. Power. Power, 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 power. They all got power. With the switch. Fuck you, door. Fuck you, door. No power. No power, no power. No power, no power. Okay, so switching the door, or sw flipping the switch is going to close the door. All will be good. I just need to give myself a nice little perch so I can see what's going on. Eh, look, a couple of security discrepancies on the back end of our arena, but I don't care too much about that. McChewy, thank you very much for the prime. I'm sorry I missed that.
If I run up here, that's a pretty good view. That's about as good of a view of the battle as I'll probably be able to get. I don't like that this power pylon's in the way, but I don't really care. Make a ring around above it? That's a lot. Yeah. I. Uh, this is good. This is okay where we're at. Right? I mean... It's not the most aesthetically pleasing arena, but I mean, it looks like a thing on the island. Wouldn't I want the switch in the tower? Yes. I would. Which is why I am going to rearrange a few things. Store the switched power pylon. Oh, don't tell me I can't put this in the... T oh, why? That's okay. We can put it right here. That works just as well. Can it reach? I doubt it can reach. Oh, baby, yes. That's as close as we're getting. All right. There we go. Our wildlife reservation is complete. Finally, wildlife can have a sanctuary where they too can... Uh... Somebody clean this up, please. Come on. It's not good for advertisers. <laughs> Finally. All right, you guys said you wanted a petting zoo slash wildlife sanctuary reservation, whatever you want to call it. We got one. That is complete. We have island games, human skeet shooting. I think that's what I'm going to settle on. Human skeet shooting. Uh, oh, I want one more thing that I want to try out. That's going to be really tough. So I want to go into, is it power miscellaneous? Firework mortar? No. So we want this. I want one of these. I want a junk mortar. Right here. Yeah, this is pretty good. That's a tough angle. And it's never it's never going to be consistent with where it shoots. But what I want is I want like Okay, let me try and explain this. So you know how we have our kickball chuck? I want a bunch of different chucks. Like, I want one in one cannon here that goes Doo! And then Chuck will fire and go over the arena. And then he'll land over here in another cannon. And then that cannon will go Doo! And it will fire Chuck back over the arena, right? And then I want the same thing on the other corner. So you've got like this X of kickballs, you know, shooting over the arena mid battle. And it'll be like this mini game to where everyone in the crowd is like, oh, are the Chucks gonna connect in mid air? Does that make any sense? I want it to be like a constant flow of Chucks shooting across the same path until they hopefully connect with each other. Are you guys saying no, you don't think it would be possible? Chuck is our kickball. But, I mean... So we've got, if you go into manufacturing, there is... the hopper. I'm not sure why it's having such a hard time being placed down. It's like really struggling to be placed. So the hopper would have to catch it. And then we would have to have... Oh, you know what? The junk mortar can probably pull from a... Pulls items out of an, of an adjacent container can... I don't think that this can be placed, the junk mortar, on a production line. But... 
I know that the hopper can drop items and you can control the force with, with, with which those items will drop out. But if it fires out, it's probably gonna, it would probably have to drop like from this angle. Like that. I don't know if that's gonna work. It probably won't. It is fun to think about, though. All right, now I want to try out some more features. So we've got the Settlement Ambush Kit. Oh, right, there's a shooting range in here. I forgot we could set this up. We can have more games. Got games right there. Uh, this is kind of like if you've ever been to a baseball game, you know how they have a pitching machine? So, like, for people who have annoying kids that don't want to watch the carnage, they can go around the side and go to the shooting range. If I can find a place to set this up where it doesn't look terrible. Uh, no, it looks bad right there. I'm going to set it up closer to the beach. This is a beach game. Yeah. Like, right here. Pretty ass. But I wonder if settlers will just use it. You know what? Let's just set up the whole beach for games. Where's the pommel horse and the weights? Not in crafting. It's, it's not in resources, is it? No, we checked this earlier. Not in food, not in water, not in defense, not in power, not in decorations. It's not in raider. Cages? No. Does anybody know what it's... Furniture? Oh, it is. Alright, cool. So we can set up beach games over here. In case people want to engage in some casual high-level gymnastics, or if they want to just casually bench 260 pounds. Beach is coming together. All sorts of fun activities. Got that over there. We got unlimited money back at the home base. People are having to sleep in shifts, making everyone a bit cranky. Cat loves the streams. He always sits with you when you watch him. His name is Carrot. Well, he would love this settlement. Carrot would absolutely love this settlement. Yeah, we won't need beds. I I'm the only one who gets a designated sleeping spot. Everyone else can share. Also, what kind of a resort needs good beds when they have so much fun? Like, we, we're not investing in the little things. We're investing in the big, big experiences. We're in the experience economy, okay? All right? Not the mm -mm 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 economy, okay? We're in, this, we're in the experience economy. Not your mm -mm 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 kind of stuff, all right? I'm doing a thing! Things are a bit Making bad. noise upstairs. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about, all right? There's a lot of <laughs> fuckers in chat. I'm, sure I'm tired of it. <laughs> Let's see what you have. Here's what I've got. But what if you want to experience a nap? You don't experience a nap. It just happens. Naps are just a thing that occur, right?
sound like your professor. He's from Michigan, and it's kind of funny when I'm not actively watching it, as if I'm listening to him stream. Your professor sounds like me, like our voices sound similar, or your professor also refers to things as... Because if he does that, well, I mean, either way, he's cool. I like your professor. <laughs> At least one of you is finally honest. After three weeks in the stocks, he's been like, you know what? I think I've come to the conclusion that this actually might suck. All right, let's 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 just see what this does. Settlement ambush. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm out of copper. Really? Used all my copper already. Are those on? Did I turn these on? Okay, they are. Got work to do. Can't talk. <sighs> All right, sleep for another day. Is that really even an accent, Midwestern? Like, what is a Midwestern accent? Somebody's, I, you know, I've gotten so many comparisons to Joe Rogan. People say I sound like Joe Rogan often, and I hate it. Because I don't sound like Joe Rogan. Can that sound effect be the new sub sound? Uh, if somebody clips it and then tags me on Discord, maybe. You ever done DMT? With elk meat? Don't think I sound like him. Yes. Excuse me. I'm sure I have something you need. I've got a few minutes to browse. Here's what I've got. Copper, copper, copper. Again, guys, upstairs a little late in the day to be grinding up wood. I don't want to be that guy, though. They got a job to do. And I'll let them do it. But I'm doing important shit down here! Doing important stuff, okay? We're making carrots, and... Todd Howard is still hanging out at camp. Uh, oh, nope, not ready. We're not ready for another show. Maybe tomorrow. Timmy, maybe tomorrow you can watch the murder show. Not tonight. Okay. Uh, which one should we try first? The fresh meat lure? Or the fake distress signal beacon? Or should we just do both at one time? I guess we could just do both. Just as easy as flipping these on. Another, oh, oh, we can't do both. Started the endless war. Okay, it starts a quest. Survive the assault. Gunners versus Spectacle Island, round one. You guys, I'm gonna need you to use guns instead of rakes. You know that, right? Don't shake your head at me. This is important. How, how bad is this going to be and where is the attack going to come from? It's very quiet. On the eve of our first raid, things were silent. The wind was chill as the hopper in the background had the best view of the entire island. The stiff smell of the harbor washed over me as I waited in anticipation. 
Where the fuck are they? I said out loud. Uh, I'm a little uncomfortable here, said the three settlers who are incorrectly placed in the stocks. Bjork is the only one who looked ready for a fight. Good on you, Bjork. Maybe they're on the other side of the island? It's way too quiet. I shouldn't be doing this. This is, no, this is not my job. All right, again, I'm in the experience economy, not security. What if they're all just out in the lake? Bjork, you see anything? Don't much care for good neighbor. That place is nothing but trouble. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Talk crap about Diamond City next though. Maybe I accidentally ended it. Fake distress signal active. Get ready. Oh, I'm ready. I'm waiting with bated breath. Survive the assault. Oh, wow. Oh, that was quick. Those guys sucked. That was easy. They don't even have good loot. Time's up, asshole. Oh, wow. Okay, it literally just drops them in right there. <gasps> A legendary? My first one. Go get him, corned beef. Show him what you're made of. Probably try not to die here, right? All right, all right, all right. That's enough horsing around. This is like the least exciting part about this. I like the security cameras better. You guys all made fun of me when I made corned beef specialize in melee combat, but look at what he's doing. There you go, boys. Okay, so very easy way to just get unlimited legendary weapons. <laughs> that is certainly cheating. 
biggest town I ever saw. Whereas this is a much more vanilla experience. What are you doing over here, cow meat? Were you scared? Get back to work. Leave these three to their job. It's very important. Hey, hey, hey. Fix your... Get back up into the... Okay. Hey, easy living. This ain't. Once again, I appreciate the honesty. You can go next. All right, we'll put you in the arena to die next. All right, now... Our other experience, again, in the experience economy, is our wildlife preservation. Lots of local donations have led to uh, the largest wildlife preserve in the Boston Harbor. It's a bit hard to see. Where are you going? Hey, fight in the arena. And you three, you're not up yet. It's not your turn. All right, the Yaogwai is certainly the king of the jungle. Hey, my, my spot. This is my location. You all go back to where the... Okay, fine. You guys want to go into the arena? Fine, go in. Have at it. Go on in. No, the, no, the door. The door. You, you guys, there are... There is a door. Look at this. When we talk about community activities and how people can work together on vacation to create their own fun experience, this is what we talk about. On Spectacle Island, only you can create your own experience. Work together with a community who loves animals just as much as you. All right, still in one piece. All right, you guys proud of yourselves? Everyone go back to work. I'm disappointed in this whole community. Each and every one of you. Ugh, I need to relax. I need something to calm me down. Can I use while in combat? I'm not in combat. But the great thing about this place is we can go immediately from that experience right into the next experience. Got company. One, two, three. Okay, we got three for three. Let's watch them from a cinematic, slow-motion angle. Give it a minute. The cannon should fire off. Very... Oh, there it goes. Oh my god, his torso just turned into like one gummy object of rubber. Oh, hi, Jabbo. Hi, hi, corn, hat. Okay, not you. I'm not interested in you. Oh, look at this one. He's contorting. 10 out of 10. The graceful maneuvering of his body. Every single joint in his limbs is so calculated and crisp. It's like he greased them up beforehand. We may need to investigate for performance enhancing drugs. I'm not really sure how he keeps landing shots on me. Todd, can you defend me? I'll just watch the show from back here. You guys seem like you have this all handled. It's over for now. Wonderful performance. This is kind of like on a cruise ship. You know how most of the entertainment on a cruise ship is kind of just a repeat of like the previous cruise that took place beforehand. That's what this really is. I'm like the sandals of the sea. Or I guess the harbor. It's more of a lake. Uh, 
I, I do hate that this show requires so much more investment. We also have to rebuild and reset up the animal adventure. Uh, you. You've been talking about how miserable life is here? Got it. Yo, 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 what the hell? What the hell? I thought you guys took them all out. You weren't supposed to leave extras. Yeah, go, go, please. Clear it out. Look at them all go. Look at the community, though. Will any of them figure out the door? Maybe she just needs a little nudge. Maybe you just need a little assistance. Let me just... Can I push you? Ah, there you go. <laughs> it's just a little bit of force was required. Really just gonna let him do all the work? I like you, Fedoro, but you're hogging all the XP. I'll let them have their fun. Let the kids play. Would I ever do the Horizon mod? I've never heard of it. Uh, but maybe. Maybe. I, I, the next time we do Fallout 4 after this, I might try one of those hardcore mods. That would be fun. The sounds of all my residents having a blast. Yeah, king of the nature preserve, Yao Guai, but then corned beef is just slightly above them. I don't know what, I don't know what prediction, I don't know what prediction was set up. What was it? And then look at that. Right after all that action, back into their little spots. Back on the carrot farm. I do want to get cameras set up again. I don't care if they're glitchy. I like them. I want the cameras. Camera number one. We are, in fact, going to try out the Todd camera again. Because why wouldn't we? That's not going to work. There's no way I can get the power line to go to it. Never mind. What I want to try is 
activating that, running somewhere, and then watching from the cameras. That's what I really want to try and do. It's like, we'll set up the security camera installation here. The monitors. There we go. We've only got a couple cameras set up. I just saved my game. Perfect. Okay, so we can look at the first one and notice all of our happy workers farming as many carrots as possible. This is so we can keep the nature preserve up and going. Number one nature preserve in all of Boston. There we go. <laughs> and then this is... Uh, so we can have a good view of our aquatic show, our water show, human skeet shooting. I think these are the only two cameras we have for now. Yeah, just those two. Well, now that we know that it's not going to completely break our game... go back and check it again I did save I have in fact saved no more frustration ah yes even better I mean this is about as good of a view as you could get <laughs> but can we make it even better I just want one camera to be Todd's face. Checking again. All right, nice. Everyone's working properly. Good to see. We love teamwork. Oh, no, no, we broke it. We put him too close. <laughs> the camera's going through him now. We got to back him up just a tad. Is there a super mutant cage? There is a super mutant cage. Astro Nerd, congratulations. You signed your acceptance letter? That is... Oh, my stream deck's not working. I was going to try and play a victory tune. All right, we're just going to move it back a little bit. Not a ton. Not too much. Uh, the camera's having trouble focusing, but it, it looks okay. <laughs> I think that's pretty good. <laughs> no, this is good. This is great. We just have to make sure that all the core functionality of this experience is working properly. That's all. I don't know why it keeps jutting back and forth, though. It's like it's trying to look around his shoulder. Wait, hold on. I want to see. Yeah, he's doing a little dance. If corralled, well, yeah, if, if you corral a bunch of them, they'll just start fighting each other. Now I want to build a... All right, I want to build an actual security camera for this experience right here. 
We could probably go into decorations, miscellaneous, basketball hoop. Probably build it backwards. Yeah, that one will work pretty good. Brick Rick, we have made some pretty good progress. Right, perfect. This one working just as intended. Over to our basketball camera. Ooh, yes, with a very good view. Now we can keep an eye on anything that's going on down here at the human skeet shooting range. All right. I like using the basketball hoop. That's a good way to where we can angle the camera to go exactly where we want. Now, I, I think the real finale, which I don't know if I have the patience or energy to figure out, would be sitting my ass down right here in the control room and flipping one switch and both the nature preserve as well as human skeet shooting go off at the exact same time. Who's shooting? Someone's actually using the range. Look at him go. Um, except, I'm sorry, my friend. I'm pretty... Wait, are you new? They might be new. Yeah, they're definitely new. All right, go you get in line with everyone else at the sacrificial center. Sorry, the nature preserve. I know, I can't shoot if anyone's watching. Oh, this fog is so ugly. Get off my screen. It's mucking up the camera center, too. Oh, I'm out of gears. It was fun while it lasted. Basically crafting with unlimited stuff. Did for yeah, Fedora's still alive. Anyone that we named is still alive. Any of the first ten original settlers are still here. Hey. Looking to buy? Let's see what you got. Great. Yeah, Fedora does. Fedora probably has the safest job security. Although the safest security job 
is defense up on the beach. She does a great job. Oh, come on. What are we doing here? on uh. fine I'll build stairs like an idiot Oh, for fuck's sake. Stop being an idiot. Thank you. Took you long enough to figure it out. Wonderful. All right, that camera should be working. Can we bring back the Meyer Lurks? I don't think it's viable. Because early on, I disconnected the power from the alarm that makes the Meyer Lurks go away, and they never came back. Yeah, that was just something we had to learn. Uh, yeah, you can spawn Meyer Lurks. I don't remember exactly what you need for a Meyer Lurks, so I think it might be dog meat. Is it cat food? No. Cat food is how you get cats. Thank you, kind sir. Love the content, Juve. Found your channel while looking for Skyrim content. Keep it up. Captain Skiff, thank you so much for the Prime. And thank you for watching the channel. It's not exactly Skyrim today, but it's uh, close enough. I figured if you've played one, you've probably played the other. Let's at least just see what that camera looks like. <gasps> Where is Todd camera? That one's actually perfect. But where's Todd camera? Oh, there's Todd camera. Don't worry. Todd camera's still good. We're all right. A camera facing me while on the monitor. A third eye. All right, let me make sure that Wilson is still okay. Or Chuck. 
<laughs> Chuck! Okay, Chuck is still here. He hasn't left. Thank you for guarding, Chuck. With the utmost discrepancy, it's the most important job on the island, Defense. You protect Chuck during all dangerous activities. Okay, now I want to try something here. Uh, ooh, we have a cannon up here we can use. Let's grab this cannon. I'm gonna have to get more steel. I can probably just afford to buy bulk steel right now, but I'd rather have water. At least make the trade a little bit easier on myself. It is, it kinda is like five nights. Come on. Let me get my water. Okay. I'll tell you what. I will name Chuck the full uh, prime minister, premier, czar, whatever you want to call him, of the island. If we can launch him from one cannon into another and create a continuous cannon launching simulation. <clears throat> you want to do some trading? Let's see what you have. Great. Oh, you're starting to get on my nerves, settlers. Looking to buy They're not dying fast enough. They're drinking all the water. I've got a few. Let me know what you... Ew, that hurts. That's a lot of money. Chancellor Chuck. He will be Chancellor Chuck of the island. All right, so in order for this to work, we have to go back into miscellaneous. Got to have a terminal. Maximum firing force, of course. Why wouldn't we max it out? Now it has to be interval switch. Should be able to control the interval. Yeah. On for one second. Uh, actually, we should probably make these as we should probably make it shoot as slow as possible. So if it's on for ten seconds, right, that only launches it once. Thank you, kind sir. So the on interval can be ten seconds. My bottom stings. Thank you for the prime. So it can be on for ten seconds. And then it'll be off for 10 seconds. That puts it at 20. 20 seconds between each launch. That would make it as controllable as possible. And now we have to track where Chuck will launch when he fires. I should probably start running to the other side like I'm a receiver. 
I'll catch you, Chuck. Don't worry. It's all in... What the fuck was that? That was embarrassing. Chuck! Chuck, come back here. What the hell was that? No, no, you can do way better than that. Come on. Come on, come on. We can do better than that. Come on, Chuck. Launch. Flight of the Valkyries. Come on, Chuck. Oh my god, what is going on? Chuck, this is embarrassing. <laughs> Stop it. Come on, we are in the experience economy, Chuck. If you can't figure this out, then you don't belong on this island. Don't, it, don't, it, stop it. Don't, do not walk away from me when I'm angry. All right. Maybe, uh, maybe we just have to, ch maybe we should lower the force. Maybe 10 uh, just messes with the game's physics. Let's let's put it on five. The recommended firing angle. That's much more of a forward launch than I'm comfortable with. But let's see. Okay, that doesn't count. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. He was getting settled. Stop. Get back. He was still rolling around in there, so it doesn't count. And he's nice and still. Oh, no. All right, I know what the problem is, though. He keeps hitting the side as he comes out. Maybe he needs to go with a more vertical launch. Oh no, Chuck, this is just so, this is just so bad. We can't be having this. Okay, lowering the firepower didn't seem to do much. So now that we're on this angle, let's change it back to power 10. Not nine. Okay, you know what? We'll go with nine. Maybe nine's the magic number. Come on, Chuck. I believe in you. What are you, anti-fun, Chuck? Although it does seem like he always consistently lands right about here. So if my theory is right, we can drop Chuck in. Back up to right about... Okay, that doesn't count. That was actually not bad. That wasn't bad, Chuck. Hey, good work. Oh... I thought we were going to be able to set up, you know, some automatic catch. Doesn't look like we'll be able to. How effectively can I launch myself? This can't, I think it's the cannon's fault. I'm not gonna blame Chuck. I think there's something wrong with my mortar. It's just anti-fun. Something's going on with it though. I mean, we could make a funnel. 
two cannons facing directly into each other. I still think that it would fire him off to the side. Unless you mean like they're literally like, like this. Boom, 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 boom. Or have a, yeah, have a Jaybird, have a bunch of Chucks all at one time and the one Chuck that makes it furthest wins. It's not a bad idea. I'm not sure how that one's not getting power. Okay, now they're both getting power. Now they're all getting power. I'm gonna be honest. I really don't know how much further we can take this, to be honest. Jared, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Tip to tip with the cannons. I'm not creative enough with the power lines. And we've already we've already been on this one single island for 16 hours. And I also do have to finish this video by Friday. <laughs> Ugh. Picky boy, what's going on is we're trying to make this island I don't really even know right now. We've just been building into it as many dumb activities as we possibly can. What's the next challenge going to be? The next challenge we're going to do on the channel will be Skyrim. We're going back to the world randomizer once again. And this will be uh, covering the update to the world randomizer inc that includes all of the DLC. That also includes Xbox support for the world randomizer. It will be on console. And then we're going to be combining two separate mods along with the world randomizer to make Skyrim officially a roguelike. So it should be a lot of fun. And I'm pretty excited to announce it and, you know, show it off. So after that video comes out, go download the mods so we can get it trending on both Xbox and on the Nexus. What are the other two mods going to do? One of them is going to be Moro loot. So it creates like static loot that's unleveled throughout the map. And then the other one will be Skyrim of War, which is the nemesis system from the Shadow of Mordor series. So like if you if you die on the run, you don't technically die. The enemy that killed you just gets a big buff and steals your gear. What hit harder, a tumbleweed leaving or the Mire? You know, when the Mire Lurks left me alone on the island, that did hurt. That, that really hurt me. What kind of staircases are there?
Oh, damn it. Why that? Why didn't I just use an elevator? That would have been way cooler. Elevator would have been awesome. Ooh. Hold on. Yeah, no, screw a staircase. If I'm going to build my big security tower where I can spy on all the activities of the island, I want a cool elevator. Only a two floor elevator. I screwed that one up. I need a four floor elevator. I gotta get more, I gotta get more gears. I don't think you can trap a uh, Mirelurk Queen. They are also very large. Want to do some trading? Let's see what you got. Great. You think you're tired of hearing the idiot savant noise? <laughs> I have been tired of it. I found another Chuck. Oh, I think hatchlings, you can't put hatchlings in your inventory, but for some reason I'm thinking that hatchlings are how you... make, uh... All right, where does command center? Command center, we'll put command center right here. It only needs five power. Ah, oh, I need gears. Can I make two of these? Oh, I need gears. Always the one thing that kills me is running out of gears. Oh, it's eggs. That's right. You need eggs. I haven't seen any uh, Mirelurk eggs. Although you might just get those for killing the Mirelurk. Could be wrong. The fog crawlers. Those are just the. Uh, those are just the chorus from Skyrim. Chorus, whatever you, uh, what are they called? How does it, how do you pronounce that? They're like a standing version of those guys from Skyrim. And also way larger. And much harder. They're kind of tough in Skyrim too. Yeah, whenever I call them a chorus, I think it's like the repeated part of a song. Sorry. Uh, apologies for my lack of energy. I think I'm... I think I'm just bored of my vacation on this island. I think I'm... I think I'm ready for it to be over. The first 12 hours took a lot out of me. <laughs> I'm sure that was a lot. I've got a few I mean, we pushed well. through. And we got to the point where we're basically invincible and we can do whatever we want but man
Was there ever a true goal? Has there ever been? Usually I just make up whatever our goal was in post. All right, so we can go all the way up here. I know what you're thinking. Hey, you're just building a box. That's like the ugliest version of a sky base you can build. <laughs> it's gonna look funny though from uh, the ground floor. My CEO's tower. <laughs> it's gonna look so stupid. Well, this is where we can put our security camera system. We can just watch from up there. No, I mean, the goal, the goal was really just see, it's always just to kind of see how far we can take the game and its systems and mechanics under sort of a limited setting. And then whatever else happens from there, we try to just have fun with. Can you put another elevator on top of that one? Ah, uh, do I have enough? I don't know if I have enough to build another elevator. We can see. Oh, I need now I need now I need wood. An island resort to compete with Nuka World? Hey, I think we're already there. I think Nuka World is overrated. Not the DLC, but just like the concept of the uh, theme park. Like, I would rather be here. Even though it's really foggy. Which is ugly and annoying. And it prevents me from seeing all the fun activities we have. We have way more to do here. We've got a shooting range. We've got a pommel horse. We have human skeet shooting. We've got Chuck. Yeah, we found an inflated kickball a while ago. We ended up just buying it from the... from the vendor. No water. But it's literally almost been a year. Kid Big, thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate it. Thank you. See, the thing with building an actual functioning battle arena is that the mechanics are so broken. It's a challenge in itself to make a working, aesthetically somewhat pleasing battle arena. I don't know if anybody was here for when we did it in the glowing sea. It was a nightmare. I have something you need. Sure. I had to like individually console command every single settler so we could do a battle royale.
Yeah, we have Todd's here too. That's a pretty sizable W. Yeah, can, can we just build another four floor elevator on top of this one? It'd be really dumb if we could. I really hope we can. Uh, oh, oh, wait. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Another four floor elevator. And enough for another generator. Now this is what I'm talking about. You can see everything. You can see everybody down on the farm. Picking out corn. You can see all the Todd's in position. The cannon fire. All right. I mean, it's not a full tower. But shit. Look at all these activities. We started from nothing. We came to this island. We had absolutely nothing. And now we have a thriving community resort. I do kind of want to just jump. Woo! All right, that was really underwhelming. Nope. Redo. Doesn't count. All right. I am I'm not going to lie. I'm uh I wonder if I can make that jump to the tower actually. Yeah, close enough. Count it. That counts. My broken foot. Um I don't really know how much further we can take this one because I'm really uh, kind of bored. And what's happening with this one is, it, is it's kind of like going in the same direction as uh, the glowing sea one did towards the end where like the challenge of it is just completely gone. Um. Do I have any ideas for an ending? Was there an ending? Uh, I mean, it, it really depends. Sometimes, like, there's a lot of times with challenges where I just will end it early or find a place that I think is a satisfying ending. But we basically just completely conquered the entire island. I can only look at the cardboard cutouts of Todd and uh, be amused by them so many times. <laughs> and I don't want to, like murder the whole population. So I think I'm going to take tomorrow and go through all of the footage or as much of it as I can and try to start just putting this video together because it needs to be out and I need to figure out an ending. If it comes down to it and I think that there's more that we can do, we will for sure give that a try. But, you know, it's really easy when we're doing these to keep going and keep streaming and keep recording 
when there's like a clear goal in mind, right? Like for a while, our, our pretty obvious and clear goal was uh, doing that loop and getting circuitry and getting to that point to where we had it. And then we finally got to that point and we were just building up the building up everything, getting to certain things. Now that we're there, it's kind of just, um, I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm, I'm ready to move on. So we'll see. I'm not sure if we'll be live on Wednesday. It depends how tomorrow goes and how I feel about the project. So if we stream or if we don't stream Wednesday, the next stream will be Friday. And that's what I'm hoping to have this video out and we'll start the next Skyrim uh, challenge then. But this video is also going to be kind of part historical coverage of the island, part trying to connect random historical events and transformations of the island to how we transformed it and what we did. Granted, all of those connections will be really stupid. So. We'll, uh, we'll see. We shall see. Cassie, I appreciate it. Thank you for stopping by. Right now, my streaming schedule, uh, scheduled streams are Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 3 to 4 p.m. CST. And uh, those, I'll stream unscheduled on weekends. Like this upcoming weekend, if I get the video out by Friday, we'll probably stream either Saturday or Sunday. One of those two days. Maybe both if I want to get ahead and I'm feeling it and I feel good. But I'm sending you guys over to Snamwich's stream again. I think he's doing the Dead Space Challenge. We've raided over there before. He's super nice. Makes great videos. Uh, remember to be respectful. Don't be assholes. And I'll catch you again. Thank you all. We'll talk soon. Hopefully this is out on Friday. That's my goal. Friday. But either way. We'll talk soon.